people? Welcome back, Car Review. So today we are looking at a card that some people talked about saying that it might be an interesting card, but I'm not so sure. So this is Dr. Frankenfein. But before we look at this effect, look, look at this art though. No. Oh my god, this man is ugly. Like Konami, what what are you doing with this art? Man, he look like a, like a beaver with them buck ass teeth. Look like he trying to look like he be Dr. Beaver went to freaking damn you. You look like a motherfucking no! <laughs> Timmy Turner's freaking pedophile ass uncle bitch ass freaking mad scientist wanna be. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> But seriously, this art is stupid. <laughs> but sometimes we don't look at the art. The art doesn't matter as long as the effect is good. So, Dr. Frankenstein, Dark, Psychic Effect Monster. Level 3. Alright, so you can emergency teleport him. 300 attack, 300 defense. Stats are pitiful. But as long as your effect is good. So, let's look at it. So, if this card is normal or special summon, you can pay 500 life points. Look at the top card of your deck. Then either place it on the bottom of your deck or reveal it and add it to your hand. But you skip your next draw phase. You can only use this effect of Dr. Frankenstein once per turn. Nah, nah, that, that, mm. All right, all right. So let me get this straight. Let me get this straight. So when I summon you, preferably special summon because hopefully I'm not wasting my normal summon in your butt because normal summon him in attack mode, 300 attack just to get this. Mm. I pay 500 life points. And I look at the top card of the deck and, did it, and either I place it at the bottom or I had to show it to you and add it to my hand. But I skip my next draw. Hey, so you think that, oh my god, you know, you go ahead and look, pay 500 and look at the top card of your deck and, you know, get to add it to your hand. That's great. You know, that's a, that's a, that's a plus because you keep your monster and you, that's a plus. But no, no, they're going to make it so you skip your next draw phase. So you get the card now instead of later. No, that's not good. This isn't, this isn't good. This isn't good. You know, uh, well, you know what? Let's just go ahead and name off some cards that I would rather play than this fool. I'd rather play Upstar Goblin. If I if I want to get the next card so bad, I'd rather Upstart give you a thousand, draw into my next card. Oh, and I don't skip my next draw phase, and I don't use my normal summon if I would normal summon this guy. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. So wait, okay, let me see. Let me see. I look at the next card and then I add it to my hand. I would rather play Pod Duality, y'all. <laughs> Hello. I mean, sure, I can't special them, but Pod Duality. I, look at the next card. I get to look at the next three cards and then get one of them cards to my hand. And I don't skip my next draw phase. And you know what? I'd rather you no know, take it slow, not special summon, and still get my draw phase next turn. So yeah, I'd rather play Pod Duality than this. Shit, I'd rather play Reckless Greed than this. Hello? I'd rather go ahead, flip up, Reckless Greed, draw two, and skip my next draw phase than use my normal summon for this guy. This is not a good card. This is, mm-mm. Uh-uh. I, I don't even know where you're getting this from. You know? And, tsh, sure, it's a psychic, but who cares? You know, I, w I wouldn't even play in a psychic deck. I wouldn't play in a psychic deck. I wouldn't even play in a Cosmo deck. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> this card. I, I don't think it's good. I, I don't see it. I don't see it. Like I said, I thought you'd maybe go ahead and go emergency teleport special summon this. Pay 500. Look at the top. And the thing is, is that you don't have a choice. It's not like you can just be like, hmm, let me go ahead and take a look. Okay, well, I don't want it right now, so I'm just going to put it on. No, either you, you pay 500. You either take the card. You either put it at the bottom of your deck where you're, you're not going to get it. Or you reveal it, show it to your opponent, and then add it to your hand. And skip your next draw phase. So you don't have a choice. Either it's going to the bottom or you're getting it, but you're skipping your next draw phase. So no, 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 absolutely no. So I think that roast that roast session was totally justified. You're just not a good card. You know, go ahead and get thrown into the freaking pile of crappy commons where you belong, Doctor Frankenstein. Because God, you're ugly and your effect is ugly too. No, thank you. No, thank you. So tell me what you guys think about this card in the comment section below. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Card Review. Of course, Card Review is only on Monday, but that's fine. That's fine. You know, we still got plenty of cards to look at. So we're just going to keep on reviewing them. But, you know, I believe it was either Vexicus or Mega Capital G, one of them two, talked about this card. And I was like, what the heck? And I was like, no. No. <laughs> you know, people were all like, oh, man, it can be used in uh, some some of them Saki decks. Like, nah, nah. If I want to draw to the next card, man, I'll play Chicken Game. <laughs> like, no thank you. <laughs> no thank you. So, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And see you guys next Monday with another card to look at. All right, people. Thanks for watching.